Hello and welcome to live coverage of Tottenham's Champions League showdown against Sporting CP. Following back-to-back -back defeats in the Premier League, Antonio Conte and his Spurs team need to bounce back with three points in Europe's Premier competition in order to get back on track after a difficult week. Top of Group D with two games remaining, the Lily Whites will secure their place in the knockout phase of the competition if they beat their Portuguese opponents. However, it won't be straightforward at all with Sporting winning the first game between the sides and also due to the fact that Ruben Amarim's team are also also in a good position to progress to the next stage of the competition. Tottenham correspondent Rob Guest is covering the match with all the build-up and the action as it happens on the pitch from inside the stadium and reaction from the supporters and media. Scroll down for all of our latest updates from Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. 21:57 Rob Guest full time it finishes 1 to 1 following the decision to rule Kane's goal out. 21:56 Rob Guest no goal Kane finds the net for Tottenham in the dying seconds after converting from Emerson's header to spark wild scenes. However, VAR ruled it out and Conti and the Spurs team are fuming. Conti sent off as a result. 21:46 Rob Guest wide Dyer with another header that just goes wide. 21:42 Rob Guest close Dyer is a matter of inches away from heading home Suns cross but he cannot get enough on it. 21:38 Rob Guest goal Spurs are level through Bentancur as he rises highest in the box to nod home P. Sporting believe their goalkeeper was fouled but the referee doesn't think so. 21:32 Rob Guest save Luris needed to produce a good stop there with Natsun Ho going through on goal. The World Cup winner saves another attempt, with Natsun Ho firing wide from not far out on a rebound. 21:31 Rob Guest over glancing header from Dyer just goes over the crossbar. 21:27 Rob Guest spurs sub Brian on for Doherty. 21:26 Rob Guest save good save from a down low down to stop Doherty's effort from Cree. Spurs didn't start too badly but once again they failed to create anything of the note in the final third, which has unfortunately continued all the way through to the halftime whistle.